man. All right, I'm finally home. Hello, everybody. I'm Mrs. Q, and welcome to my YouTube channel. First of all, I would like to thank all my subscribers. Thank you, thank you, thank you for subscribing to my channel. That means you like my videos. And if you like my videos, haven't subscribed yet, hey, what you waiting on? Click the subscribe button and get in there and get more of me, Mrs. Q, and my silent and absent co-host, CJ. <laughs> Where's CJ, you may ask? I don't know. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Hi, everybody. Sorry I'm late. It was due to circumstances beyond my control. Okay. Oh, goodness gracious. I'm tired. I'm warm. I'm having one of my personal summers right now. Um, Because for some reason, um, people left here and forgot to leave down. <laughs> Anyway, thank you for all that are here. Thank you for rocking with me. You know, like I said, due to circumstances beyond my control, I was supposed to be here like an hour and five minutes, ten minutes ago. Oh, God. But here I am. Traffic, three accidents, almost four later, I'm finally home. Lord. Please don't let any of the accidents that I saw today result in casualties. These and other blessings I ask you in Jesus' name, I do pray. Amen. I don't know what's going on in San Antonio, Texas today, but these folks act like they can't drive. Three accidents? Then one lady almost hit me. How you almost hit me? And then gonna blow at me. I'm in my lane, minding my business. But you almost hit me and gonna blow at me. Really? Really? <sighs> Whatever. It was crazy. And to top it all off, it's Friday in Texas. Y'all know what that means. Friday night lights. Because I passed um university of texas at san antonio i don't know what they got going on over there then i passed one of the district stadiums so top put that on top of three traffic three accidents later it ain't never taken me this long to get home i left my job at five o'clock 508 to be exact i was pulling out the parking lot and i got home Literally three minutes ago. That's why I was kind of out of breath and I'm warm and ain't no air on up in this place. Okay, so that's going to be my rant for the night. <laughs> for real, for real. Um, today is Friday, August 31st. Turn this air on. 2018. And it is time for For Real Friday with your girl, Mrs. Q. For real, for real. Okay? Okay. So if you're still up, because I know a lot of my East Coast people are probably either on their way home from somewhere, on their way to bed. Who knows? They're probably taking a bubble bath. There ain't no telling what they're doing right about now. But if you're rocking with me, I thank you for rocking with me because you could have been anywhere else, but you chose to be right here. Even though I'm late. Tardy for the party. <laughs> All right, so we're going to try to get this air on. It is 74 degrees up in here, and it's warm. So we got to get some air. That's one thing you can't do in Texas. You got to have some air. Goodness. All right, so let's see who all is here. Hi, the closet dive. Hi, Freon, Crutz, Crutz. One day I'm going to pronounce the right. Just let me know which way it is. Hi, Poke 70. Let's see here. Who else is here? Hi, Tiapo. Hi, Sabrina Weekfall. Hi, M2 or M Squared. There's M Squared. <laughs> 
So, I hope everybody's doing well this fine Friday night. And, um, yeah, I'm doing okay. I mean, I was supposed to, um, I do apologize. I was supposed to do a flashback, post a flashback, I mean, throwback Thursday video last night. But, honey, we had a shopping emergency. We was getting our shop on, okay? Y'all already know where I was. I know I got one around here somewhere. Dennis, how I really love Dennis. It's one of my favorite department stores. You get what you want and more. Y'all know. Damn it. Did I mention I really love Damn it? All right, y'all. It is time for the first PSA of the night. I wanted to say day, but if I had been hurt, I probably could have said day. All right. So, first PSA of the day. Brahmanistas, Dunanistas, Cochettes, MKers. Tori, no, not Tori Birch. Patricia Nash. And right now, Dennis is having another clearance savings event. Oh, yes. You thought it was over? Think again. Right now at Dillard's, they are having an extra 40% off all clearance handbags all oh, clearance handbags mm -hmm. for real for real all oh, clearance handbags 40 percent now i'm gonna tell y'all like this here like this here like this here just because you don't see a bag in the clearance section does not necessarily mean that it's not on clearance i'm gonna tell you why in a few minutes I, I just can't believe that they still doing this here. Okay. So, what's happening is some bags are marked down, but they're not in the clearance section. They're still in their place because they want the display. They want to get the display. They still want the display to look pretty. But you know, your girl, Mrs. Q, you know, I be looking, I be looking. Hi, I'm Prince Happy too. Hi, Mommy Face. Yes, I'll be looking. Hi, Florentine Quack. Yes, and I'm going to tell y'all why. I'm going to tell you how. No, I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to tell you. So, last night when I was in Dillard's, uh, before I went up to the women's department, I told y'all when, the, when they have sales like this, this is when I get my Calvin Klein blouses, among other things. Let's just say I left there with 15 blouses, one blouse for my sister, so that's a total of 16, and one dress, and I spent $182. Mm -hmm. Four of those blouses were Calvin Klein, regular price, 50 some dollars. Mm -hmm. For real, for real. Because y'all already know I had a 10% off reward. And I left with one bag. Just one, just one. That's all I left with was one. And um, yeah. So anyway, I spotted this gentleman walking around with one of the sales associates. And I like, I can't remember her name. I think it's Margo. But he was walking around with one of the sales associates. Got the lady carrying all these bags. I'm thinking it's for her, they for him. And if you think I'm lying, Y'all know me. I'm going to show you a picture. Hold up. I'm coming. But anyway, for those of you all who are just joining me, Dillard's Clearance Event, 40% off all clearance handbags. All clearance handbags. I repeat, 40% off all clearance handbags. Where's the picture of this lady? With carrying all this man's handbags that he gonna buy. I said, would you look at this here? I 
going through to see if I can find it because I snapped a picture. But the question is, where is it? Ah, there she is. That's the sales associate. And the guy, he's like around the corner. That's who she's talking to. And she got one, two, three, four, five, six handbags in one hand and five handbags in the other. Y'all can't see the other one. Y'all can't see her other hand. On this picture, she don't have them. But by the time she went back to the counter, she had five in the other one. That man bought all those bags. Now, this night, particular night, anytime dealers have a sale like this, the first night is for card holders only. And the only way you can get the discount is if you use your dealer's card. Mm -hmm. For real, for real. So, if you want to pay with another method of payment, I'm, I'm sorry. You know, you have to wait till the next day when the sale is open to everybody. But I'm just saying. You know what, Closet Dive, he probably was an eBay. -er. Ain't no telling, because you can tell when they have a sale because you start seeing all the sale bags online and then they charging either regular price or absorbing them out. I can't stand those people. And anyway, whatever. Mm -hmm. I ain't going to be a hater because if they let them do it, they let them do it. But then all of a sudden today, you're limited to six bags. Really, dealers? I'm glad I didn't want six, but that's not the point. <laughs> anyway, reason why it took me a while, because, you know, I took I took some pictures, you know, of the merchandise. Now, even though the dealers at the shops of La Cantera in here in San Antonio, Texas, is my home store because it is the closest to me, this store right here, the dealers at North Star Mall, you talk about the selection. OMG. They have a selection of MK. Now, their coach selection is lacking. I'm just going to be honest. It's lacking. And um, they have a decent selection of Patricia Nash. Better than my home store. Uh, you know. But the Brahmin and the Dooney selection. Now, I couldn't take a picture of all the duty selection. I didn't know my battery was my battery was low. But if you are a member of Brahmin Handbags and Accessories DSB, then uh, I will be posting pictures soon of the eye candy. Mm -hmm. For real, for real. But, uh, man, y'all see I'm still swiping. All these pictures of the, ba of the Brahmin selection. Oh, my gosh. For some reason... I am in love with this pattern. I don't know why this bag right here, I, I don't know why. I don't know what it is. When you see it in the store, it's so pretty. It's so shiny. I'm just saying. Now, for those of you who are in Brahmin Handbags and Accessories DSB or in Brahmin Handbag Addicts, uh, some people were, uh, well, mainly me, was posting pictures of uh, what they had on sale because they didn't have a lot of collections on sale. But um, this is what was left last night. The lady said that whole, that whole display was full of Brahmin that was on sale, but that was what was left last night when I got there. Okay? Yes, that is a thermal. <laughs> that, uh, uh, and a pecan one at that. Okay? They had some actual pecan toasted almond pieces on sale. So, like I said, that is a thema. A lot of ladies have been looking for the pecan thema. They had three at this store, and they had two at the shops of La Cantera. Okay? Another bag that's popular, that bag right there is the Farrah bag. Why is it popular? Because it's light, it's roomy. And it passes the elbow test. How do I know? Okay, Miss Q gonna be home shortly. So if I start whispering, that's why. Not oh, don't don't get it twisted. I ain't scared. It's just that I don't want to talk about it. <laughs> for real, for real. Okay, one of the other bags that's popular. That's the Sydney right there. That's another bag that's popular. Oh, the bag of the day. Sorry, y'all. 
The bag of the day is um Amara Hobo in Washington to go. I I look what I got on. I had to wear her. <laughs> I'm just saying, for real, for real. You know, so and um, but yeah. Ooh, and the other popular bag that people will hunt down, one lady said somebody snatched it out of her hand at dealers. Is the um, um hopper and toasted almond. Now these two bags right here, I'm not exactly sure what they are, but this is the regular size, and of course that's the little sis. So I just thought they were so cute. They're not, not cute enough for me, but I'm just saying it's too small. It's too, too small for me. It's cute. Hi back now. <laughs> Love the video. Um, on the um, what is that collection? And Dunia the six one five was on live last night, and that's the reason why I missed her live because I was shopping down up in Dillard's. Okay, Dillard's. I'm just saying how I really thank you. Pray um, Pope seventy Beacon. Yeah, love your um, cause I was gonna talk about Beacon. Okay, for those of you just joining me, Dillard's is having their clearance event, extra forty percent off all clearance handbags, Coach. Michael Kors, Brahmin, Patricia Nash. Oh, Patricia Nash. Mm, 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 mm. Man, I'm telling you, the option of oh, just shopping is just so good in here. Now, I don't know what this pattern is called, but to me, it kind of looks it rem it's reminiscent of camouflage. <laughs> oh, I was shocked that they had Arden satchels left. That's the Arden right there. I, I was shocked. Now, they didn't have much Dooney and Burke left. It was like the Dooney and Burke Hawks just came in, and there was like maybe four or five Dooney and Burke bags left. <laughs> uh, of course, they had a few crossbodies left, not much. I can't wait to see what you put, picked up during the live stream. Are you asking what I picked up? No, I haven't seen what you picked up. I'm, trust me, I'm making my rounds. I've been busy at work. My counterpart is on leave, so I've had um, some extra duties. So, you know, but I'm getting around. Is it posted? Is it? Did you post it yet? Lisa Jones. Hi, Lisa Jones. She said you got you some coach beauties on Thursday. What? All right, now. All right. But yeah, they have a few uh, crossbodies left. Hi, Mocha Queen. What is the name of the crossbody? Um, you talking about that one? The lip, the little bitty one. I'm trying to remember what is the name of that crossbody. I have one. I have one. But that one is the mini Duxbury. It don't look like it, but it is. Oh, yeah. The coach outlet has sales coming up. Let's get on with these PSAs. Y'all know me. I will talk about Dillard's and what I saw. I'm just going to show y'all the Patricia Nash. Her luggage never goes on sale. But this particular night, they had a few of her bags on sale. And um, there's Beacon. Um, I saw Dunia at 615's Beacon uh, review on my way home from the city. It was late too, but I'm glad she was on, um, that she had did her live because listening to her video, it kept me awake driving home because I was tired as heck. I went to the dentist that day and everything. But anyway, this leather is so sick. Stiff. It is truly vaquetta. I don't believe I'll be getting one of these. Okay. I I I try to put my phone. This one was the one I really liked. Hold up, it's washing it out. That one. That one was the one I really did like. But I try to put my phone. It, it's too stiff for me. It's too stiff. And um I think Backhound did her review on that one. I think because I'm listening while I'm driving. 
can't watch and drive, but I can listen and drive. <laughs> and Dooney Addict 615 did her review on that one. Okay. So, and I must admit, even though it does not pass the elbow test, it, it does fit over my shoulder comfortably, but I just, I, I, mm, not for me. Then, of course, I went up to housewares like a big dummy. We ain't going to worry about that. Let's get to the bags. This is Mrs. Q's handbags. So, we're going to talk about handbags. Uh, and um, we'll talk about luggage another video. Okay. So, by the way, speaking of luggage, did anybody know that Bessie Johnson is making luggage? For real, for real. Every, matter of fact, on November 10th, the North Star Dealers is having a meet and greet with Bessie Johnson. No, I will not be going. Womp, womp, womp. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Anyway, here we go. So, the Patricia Nash Navy floral print bags were on sale for, they were 30% off plus an extra 40% off. And um, they had the rolling duffel, regular price, $349. I think I made it $120 something. And I didn't see the 16 inch spinner. They had sold out of that one. And they also had the 22, wait a minute, 22 inch upright. I didn't see no 22 inch upright. The only ones they had was the rolling duffel. This is the rolling duffel for those of y'all who don't know. That's the rolling duffel. It's the way I took the picture, y'all. And um, it was on clearance for $244.30, but you took an extra 40% off of that. They had the Riviera duffel. Let's see if I can. They had the Riviera duffel. That's the one with the, the maps on it. That one was nice. It was on sale for $209.30. And they basically had it in like uh pecan or natural toasted almond and they did have navy they did have navy right and then they had this rich i don't know it was sort of like a bordeaux type color now the pictures it looked black but it's more of like a maroon bordeaux looking color I was going to get the rolling one for my sister, but me and those zippers. I'm going to email Trisha Nash about those zippers because me and those zippers weren't working. Incoming! Look who's here! He's here! He's here! It's CJ! M Squared asked Mrs. Q, have you had the Patricia Nash luggage before? No, I have not. And the luggage bag ones that were on sale, which according to the sign was the... The other two, the 16-inch spinner and the 22-inch upright were sold out of the patterns that were on sale because they had some other ones in there because I asked him, I said, are those on sale? He said, no. I was like, well, the sign said, he said, that's the different set. So the set that was on sale was the um, navy floral pattern, which was, let me show y'all what the floral pattern is. Come on, phone. Here we go. Y'all can't see it, but see the different... See the waves in it? Kind of like my crossbody. That's the one that was on sale. They had the luggage in that pattern on sale. But it was sold out by the time I got there. You know what I'm saying? For real, for real. Oh, my gosh. Hi, Pauline. Pauline Newman's here. Yay. I've missed you so, Pauline. Yes. And I will be going to, hopefully tomorrow, going to Sephora. Mm -hmm. For real, for real. All right, so enough of Dillard's. But, yeah, so basically Dillard's got all the bags that you're looking for on sale. The clearance anyway. No regular price. Womp, womp, womp. Okay, 
So let's get to the part about where I was seeing how some bags were on sale, but they weren't on the clearance rack. So this is my advice to you. If you're going to a sale, especially at dealers, if you see one style of, that, of a bag on sale, look at all the styles and all the colors. Look at the tags, because sometimes they mark them down and they don't move them. Hence, I'm going to show y'all. The, the, um, remember the, the, uh, the bag I told y'all about? Now, the Farrah. Hello? Hey, babe. What you getting? Well, let me know. I'm on my live. You don't want none. <laughs> well, if you want to get chicken, um, make sure you give me some mashed potatoes. Mm. Pie pie. I'll take a pie pie. I don't like their potatoes. I thought you was going to pie pies. Well, let me know. I'm on my live now. Bye. Okay. That was Miss Q, y'all. Well, y'all know that was Miss Q. Anyway, so what I was seeing was like the Annika. They didn't have no Annikas on sale. Hi, Beverly Johnson. However, if you look at this price tag right here, the Annika and Toasted Almond, or like I like to call it the Anika, it is exclusively at Dillard's. That's how you know it's the toasted almond. Clearance. So if you was looking for the Annika or Anika in toasted almond, it is on clearance, which means it's an extra 40% off. I'm just saying, for real, for real. Yeah, that's how I found, um, what was that other bag I had? And see, Farrah wasn't on the display at all. However, Farrah was on sale. I'm just saying, for real, for real, it was on sale. So, yeah. So, like I said, whenever you go to a sale, look at all the bags. Don't, if you even think it's on sale, ask them to do a price check. You never know. I do it at the outlet all the time. I'm just saying, for real, for real. All right, y'all. Let's do some more PSAs. Brahmin. The Brahmin Boutiques. The Brahmin Boutiques are... Um, they are having a sale on um they're having a sale they're having a sale on their clearance it's an extra 20 percent off all clearance but only way you can get it is if you shop in store womp, womp, womp. they are not shipping because it's labor day you ain't got no regular price bags or something. I ain't gonna trip because uh, I ain't gonna trip because they just had they just price match for the um the belt charity sale. And speaking of belt, so if you're near a boutique, which a lot of us aren't, y'all can go into the store. <laughs> Y'all can go into the store and um, y'all can shop the uh, clearance that's on sale, extra twenty percent off. Now I'm not exactly sure what the outlets got going on because I haven't seen an email, um, Brahmin wise anyway. So yeah, for real, for real. Anyway, Sephora. Hi, Pauline Newman. 
Pauline Newman, let me know that Sephora is doing, um, and I got the email today. Um, the, the Beauty Inside Appreciation event, where it's 10% off unlimited use in store, online, one time use, if you use the code Yes Insider. Okay? So if you need some stuff and you're not one of those, uh, what do they call it? Those premier members. What, what do they call y'all, Pauline? Do the attic, wherever you are. That wouldn't be me. <laughs> you know. Yeah. But that sale is on from August 30th to September 3rd. A VIB Rogue member. So if you're a VIB Rogue member, you probably get more discount than I would. But, uh... I'm not a VIB Rogue member. You know, what, what, what. How do that at 615? I was just talking about you, girl. But anyway, yeah. Ladies like her, they're probably VIB Rogue members. That is not me. <laughs> oh, I'm just saying, for real, for real. So, let's see what else we got. Um, Dooney and Burke factory stores. If you were eyeing something at the factory store right now, Dooney and Burke for the Labor Day, they're having twenty percent off. It's watching out like that because that's how it looks. See on in the uh, in the actual thing. So Labor Day sale, August thirty first to September third. 20% off at the outlet. For real. For real. <laughs> Let's see. Teresa Johnson. Hi, Teresa. Say she just bought quite a bit at Sephora as well. Like I said, I had already bought some stuff. So, but yeah, like I said, I've been wanting to try Fenty. So, with this 10% off, it's a little discount. You know. I'm going to go and see if I can get me a better shade of um, foundation and makeup. Now, don't get me wrong. I love MAC, but I just feel like there, there's a better shade, a better darker shade that will match my skin better. And um, I'm hoping that they have something. Pauline said, I would love it. Okay, cool. All right. So, yeah. Um, so, at the outlets... It says the 20% off cannot be combined with other offers. It's while supplies last. Product availability may vary by store, which we all know that by all the outlets. It excludes clearance. Womp, womp, womp. So no clearance for 20% off, just the other stuff. Okay? Not redeemable for cash and part of full. I'm not going to even say nothing. Not valid on previously purchased merchandise. So, so for those of us who was able to shop Dooney Addict Six One Fives live from Orlando last weekend? What was that last Sunday? We didn't miss out on nothing because what I bought was on clearance, so I wouldn't have been able to get the twenty percent off anyway. For real, for real. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. So yeah, some exclusions may apply. Offer available in D and B factory stores only. But that's all good. Because that seems to be the running thing with Dooney and Burke this weekend. Because the regular Dooney and Burke site is also having 20% off. For real, for real. Oh, wait. You, 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 you saw something that I love Dooney that you wanted? Never fear. I love Dooney is also having 20% off. <laughs> for real, for real. I can't find it in this email, but... Trust and believe when I say Dooney and Burke, hold up, it's having 20% off sale as well. Matter of fact, I love Dooney started their sale first, if I'm not mistaken. And then Dooney and Burke did a peaky peekaboo start on last night, I believe. It was yesterday. So, yeah. For real, for real. I'm just saying. So, yeah. So, if you've been one son from I Love Dooney, like me. Let me tell you about I Love Doom. So y'all know I've been looking for my Dallas Cowboy bag. The zip zip is going to be too small because I actually saw it in dealers at the, at the last sale 
That's going to be too small. See, if I'm going to floss with my Dooney Bird Dallas Cowboy bag, I needed to be a nice size bag. So I was looking for the tote. And little did I know that they previously had it at the outlet. But, of course, I wasn't near an outlet when, at the time I was in transition to Hira. So I've been looking for it. I love Dooney had it on their site. Dooney.com had it on their site. It was 156 on I Love Dooney and 176, I believe, on Dooney.com. Okay, how about when the sale came on it disappeared? For real, for real. I know, right? I... Whatever. Whatever. I'm gonna get my bag this weekend. I'm going to stop playing because I need it for work. I need it to be able to hold my stuff for when I go to work. But I hate when they do that. I hate when they, is it me? They just playing with our emotions, giving us heart palpitations. He flip-flopping these prices. You know what I'm saying? For real, for real. I'm just saying. So anybody out there who still need accessories, with your cruise gear, they still have some left and they're 20% off of the sale price. What are you waiting on? What are you waiting on? You're not going to get no better than that. The sale price. 20% off at the sale price. Whatever. Whatever. I'm, I'm done. I'm done. I'm off my soapbox now. Macy's, as y'all know, Macy's is always having a sale. Good old Macy's, we can count on you for at least 20% off. For real, for real. Now, for some of y'all, I'm just saying that love Macy's. I'm one of those people that love Macy's, but I have yet to find my Macy's home. For real, for real. I, oh, Lord, I'm just saying. I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm trying not to buy anything else. My last buy will be my Dallas Cowboy bag because I need to floss next weekend. Not next weekend, next Friday. So when I get off of here tonight, oh darn, I'm supposed to be doing a live on Facebook. Oh well, anyway, for real, for real. We, we might do that tomorrow. Anyway, I was in the traffic. I didn't factor all of that in. I'm just saying. For real, for real. I did. I did. So, yeah. But anyway, when I get off of here, I'm going to get my bag. I'm just saying, because uh, if I keep on, the bag going to disappear. Hi, Phil. How are you? Coolio, I hope you're doing well. So, yeah. So, don't forget, Macy's got 20% off. For those of you all who like Vera Bradley, they are seeing they have... 25% off select travel styles. Now, at one point, I was looking for a travel style, but I ain't gonna lie. I gave up because everywhere I went, they didn't have it. Or if they had it, it seemed like something was wrong with it. One bag looked like somebody done sat in it and rolled across the floor a couple of times. In it. And I'm like, how was y'all selling this? But for real, for real. But never mind. Anyway, moving on. So, what else we got? We did Dooney and Dooney.com. Dooney Factory Stores. I love Dooney. Bath and Body Works. Well, this is non-handbag related, but if you like me and you like to smell good, then just know, um, right now, Bath and Body Works has 50% off select items. And for tonight only, it's free shipping. So, if there was anything you wanted from Bath and Body Works... Um, tonight would be a good night to get it. Free shipping. Free, free. Das is free. They got 50% off some stuff. Yes, more candles. Do the added 615. I went back and, um, at the last sale that they had, I had a credit and coupons. I was dangerous. Do you hear me? I was trying to find some stuff to buy. And for some reason, I walked by the table of candles and I smelled the smell that I hadn't smelled since... For Pope, that was back in 1999. <laughs> so I ended up with these Magnolia candles. They remind me so much of Louisiana. So I bought two. Oh my gosh, I've been burning them ever since. They smell wonderful. 
Yes. And I've been uh, burning my stress relief candles when I take my bubble bath. The Zen. Um, also, they have the buy three, get three. That's the best time. If you're looking for certain scents, buy three, get three. That's the best sale that they have, except for, you know, the, the annual clearance event that they have. I'm just saying. But, yeah, otherwise, buy three, get three. I'm just saying, for free. And the uh, three wick candles starting the day are $12.95, which is a good deal. And, um, of course, they're saying 50% off select items. I love the way email do that. <laughs> for real, for real. So, yeah. I'm just saying, so for all of my Bath and Body Work family, let's hit it. If you didn't take advantage of the uh, annual sale, you, hey, let's go. Michael Kors claimed they got an extra 25% off going on now through the weekend. Now, is it me? Or when you, the extra 25% off already reduced styles don't still don't seem like a sale. For real, for real. I'm just, maybe it's just me. Because when I go, I'm like, that ain't no sale. But if you want to take a chance, go ahead and look at microcores.com. Or if you're near a microcores store, go on in. And um, it's not. I, it, I guess it's just me. Oh, do you have to say it's not? Okay, so it's not just me. <laughs> for real, for real. I'm just saying. I mean... That's why I haven't bought anything, Michael Kors. It's only certain stuff I like. I like Pebble Leather. That's my favorite. That was my first Dunenberg bag was Pebble Leather. Thank you, Jesus, because I had that bag for a long, 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 long time. Matter of fact, I still got it, but whatever. Anyway, so, yeah. But, um, well, not the first bag, the second bag I bought. Okay, so we done did Michael Kors, Bath and Body Works. Just know, just about everybody you can think of is having some sort of sale. Timberland.com. Extra 20% off sale items. Deontay Bates. My son loves Timberland. For real, for real. <laughs> Ooh, I wish I could show y'all these custom-made boots he got. We got them for Christmas. He, he designed them himself. We just bought them. I'm just saying, for real, for real. Oh, they were awesome. Um, Overstock.com has a 15% off coupon. So anybody that needs some off of there, head on over there. And uh, that's my Chick-fil-A. The container store up to 25% off on our strongest garage sale. Now, I don't need that. I need some stuff for my shoes and my bags. Come on now. Otherwise, um, Coach released their uh, collection finally. The next coach event is supposed to be the 12th of September. Some people are saying it's supposed to be 30%. Other people are saying it's supposed to be 12%. But it don't matter because they don't excluded a lot of the stuff that we're trying to get on sale. Like the Selena Gomez collection. Like Rogue. Like the Dreamer bags. Like the Parkers. I mean... And it's three other bags they done excluded. I mean, so what's going to be on sale? Belts? Keychains? Shoes? Are you kidding me? Y'all can keep that sale. I'm just saying. For real, for real. Let's see. Closet, I said, did you mention Dooley Outlet extra 20% off? Yes, I did. I did. I did. Well, actually, it's not on clearance. It's on the store. It's excludes clearance, according to my email. For real, for real. But I'm going to leave Coach alone because as soon as they have some come down in my price range. <laughs> Which is why I have been trying to sell some of my other bags so I can get some other bags that I really like. We're going to keep our deal with Mr. Q. Oh, thank you all, by the way. My, my um, handbag sale did go well. I still have a few Dune and Burks, but... Um, like I said, right now it's a buyer's market. You see that it came out with every Dooney Avenue that you think of is having a sale right now. So, hey, some stuff we just going to have. <laughs> for real, for real. All right. I think that's all the PSAs, y'all. I think that's all the PSAs. So, um, 
Did I did I miss anybody? And did I miss anything? I am not going to the outlets this weekend. We not going. We got 10 sales we gotta prepare for. I'm just saying, for real, for real. I already got my coat. Even though I had to, I, I bought a new one. Oh, here, here. I bought a new one because QVC was having a sale. Uh-huh. For real, for real. QVC had coats on sale for $45. I saw that coat for $45. I was like, wait, 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 wait. Hold up. Ain't that the same coat I paid $89 for two years ago? For real, for real. Yes. And they fit me, Miss Fluffy. They sure did. Mm -hmm. For real, for real. So, yeah. Oh, QVC. I, I thought I had marked something for QVC. Trying to see if I can find it. Um, Belk is having a sale. Of course, they have, They got a 25% pass out there right now. So, if you shop at Belk, make sure you check your email. Let me see here if I can find it. This weekend, only free shipping on orders of $49 or more. Uh, Labor Day sale. This is what the email looks like. Of course, you know they have bonus buys. You can go get your shopping pass. Um, and according to this, Labor Day sale, extra 25% off regular and sale purchases. 15% off home. And of course, they got clearance, but wait, 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 wait. Oh, that's a shopping pass. So, yeah. So, if you shop at Belt, whoop, there it is. All right. So, QVC, Labor Day weekend clearance and TSV pre-sales are here. That's what the email says. Okay. Remember I was telling y'all about they might try to close my account because I sent a lot of uh, returns back. How about they send me a letter? Really, QVC? Oh, so, wait a minute. You mean y'all ain't counting the three times y'all send me them old beat up damaged bags? Y'all y'all counted those times too? I'm just saying. For real? Y'all counted those times? Those three times? Remember that one time the, 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 the zip sack? Remember? I gave that bag four chances. They sent me four messed up bags. For real, for real. They counted that. Then remember the um the what you do the bag the Barlow bag the one that they advertised but didn't say it was a small until people start returning them because they were too small for real for real you didn't say it was small in your advertisement but when you went to the people start returning them then you start listening to it as the small Barlow Florentine y'all remember the Florentine it was one of my flashback bag really y'all counted that y'all false advertisement. I'm trying to tell me how to shop. I know how to shop. You can't tell me how to shop. And if the shoes is too small, what you expect me to do? I ain't finna pay for no shoes that's too small. For real, for real. I sent back four pairs because they was too small. I'm just saying, really, QVC? Really? I done bought more stuff than I sent back. They counted that. Really? Not to mention the two... Dune and Burke Kingston that they sent me with the messed up backs. Really? Y'all counted that? How is that counted against me? Well, I tell you what. The day you close my account will be the last day you see a cent out of my bank account. How about that? For real. For real. I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done. All right. I guess I had two rants, huh? <laughs> How you gonna count that against me? Lord Jesus. All right. Hi, Andrea. Lisa. Yeah, CJ, he hears something outside. That, that's just been him lately. Mr. Q ain't even here. He probably stopped somewhere to get some food. Okay, let's see. Do we have any questions? Any concerns? Do the access? Appeal it. I ain't worried about them. They better not close my account. <laughs> it was kind of like one of those friendly, like, hey, we noticed that you've had so many returns since March of, what did they say? No, June of 2017. 
Really? But then you advertise on your website uh, free exchange of returns, and then when you showing them bags, you be like, oh, if you don't like it, you can send it back. Or you got a 30-day guarantee. Go ahead, wear that bag. So and so and so. And if you don't like it, you can send it back. Mean what you're saying, say what you mean. That's all I'm saying, you know. Whatever. 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 All right, y'all. So it's kind of late. I still can't believe it took me three hours to get home today. Because I was really wanting to get home because I was supposed to do my beauty haul video on Wednesday and I ended up working late so I didn't get home on time. Womp, womp, womp. Who calls a meeting 10 minutes prior to you getting home? Then, <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> then I had um, my demo appointment Thursday. Found out Mr. Q made my car service appointment on Monday. He a hater. Don't be hating because I got the day off and you don't. Just a hater. I don't be hating when I got to get up in the morning and go to work and you still sleep. For real, for real. I'm just saying. <laughs> so y'all know payback was in order. Like I said, I shut them down. I shut dealers down. Just saying. And do that 615 you weren't here earlier, but thank you for your video, honey, because that kept me up on the way home because I was tired. <laughs> I was tired. I was walking out of the store like this. Oh, God. <laughs> All right, y'all. Again, <laughs> thank y'all for joining me tonight. I really do appreciate it. And um, for those those of you out there that make videos, let me know how y'all like in the Beacon Collection if you did order a Beacon bag or bought one. You know, like I said, for me, it's going to be a no after seeing um, Backhound and Duniatic 615's video. And um, what happened was, I, um, even though I saw it in the dealers last night and I tried putting my phone in, I just couldn't. I just like, I, I, I don't think, I don't think, I don't think I could. It's so stiff. There's no give. And then, um, Duny at 615 was talking about a wrinkle, something like a wrinkle in the leather. I saw that. And if it scratches, oh, I took pictures. I took pictures. Let me see if you can see it on my phone. Because she was trying to show us last night, but I was driving and listening, so I could <laughs> okay, so Dunia 615. This was the crossbody. Saw this in Dillard's. And this is red. And to me, like you said, it wasn't a true red. It didn't, it didn't pop. It didn't do it. kind of looked like brick to me. You know what I'm saying? Hi, Carolyn. Um and then it got that lit, lit old strap. That's what it looked like if you open it up. It is so little. I'm like, uh-uh, I can't do that. Nope, can't do that. <laughs> the, now, I ain't going to lie. The color is the colors are nice. Okay, so here's one of the pictures I took of the scratch. See if y'all can see, see the scratch right there. And I tried rubbing it with my finger. I tried reaching in there, getting the dust bag and rubbing it. And nope, it was still there. Yeah. Might need. Now, I know Coach has some bags. This, to me, is kind of like the gloved hand leather. But who am I to go get some Coach cleaner while I'm in the store and rub it on the bag? Squares, you have a good night. But um, how say to me? But yeah, so I do see what you were talking about about you know scratches, and I took one with the flash. It blends in very well. That's the scratch right there. Oh, I will. 
I'm gonna check out your video too as soon as I get off of here. Because the other thing I have to do is I have to go get my Dallas Cowboy bag. And hopefully it gets here by Friday. That's wishful thinking, ain't it? <laughs> for real, for real. <laughs> but um, yeah. So like I said, this was their very nice, pretty display. Kind of look like disco sitting. Isn't that pretty? Isn't that nice? <laughs> I mean, that is the bag is pretty. It looks nice. <sighs> yeah. It's going to be a no for me. I, I just can't see it. I can't find my picture with the wrinkle in it. So y'all can see exactly what I'm talking about, but... Oh well. Only difference is, and I'm gonna be honest, I like the alto leather better. <laughs> Says the lady without an alto bag. <laughs> Hi, Doris Keith. <laughs> hey, I plan on getting my bag. Plan on getting it soon. When I go to the tent sale, I hope and pray I get one. I finally, finally, finalized my flight info last night. Thank you. Goodness. For those of you who are going to the tent sale, um, you might want to go on ahead and secure that flight as soon as you see the prices go back down because I got, I finally secured my flight last night because I just said, man, bump it. I'm just going to go straight to Delta and book it. And thank goodness I did because I was able to use some of my um, my Sky Miles. Oh, yeah, for real, for real. You know. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> and uh, I went on ahead and got my ticket at a reasonable price. You know, got me one of them nice, comfortable seats that used to be the regular seats on the plane. Not going to go into the number rent, y'all. I'm just saying. So, yeah. So, once y'all see the prices go back down, I'm just saying, go ahead and um, secure that flight. From, um, who was that say? Hi, Sandy Chris. Sandy Chris says, ask what's a tent sale? I'm glad you asked. A tent sale, well, the tent sale for Duny and Burke is at Duny and Burke headquarters. And um, what they're going to do is, it's going to be a tent, just like if you were going to a circus, but it's at Dooney on their property, and they're going to have bags out there on tables, and you can buy stuff. And you might see sample bags, and they're going to be nice prices, um, sometimes cheaper than the outlet. Sometimes you will find bags that you hadn't seen in a while, and it's on every Dooney Nisa's bucket list to go. I'm finally gonna go. I'm finally gonna go. I got my ticket, got my ticket. I'm finally gonna go. So, for those of you who are going, I will see you there. For those of you who are not, maybe next time. You know, sometimes it's just not your time to do stuff. That's what I had to tell somebody today. Sometimes it's just not your time. For a long time, I'll tell y'all a story. For a long time, I was in this one position. And I ain't going to lie, I didn't apply for no other jobs because in that position, I go to work, do my job. I can do my homework at work because I was working on my degree. And I didn't have no problem, nobody messing with me. And then when it came time to try to um, get upgraded, oh, my God. Seemed like it was taking forever and I was getting frustrated. Besides some of the forces working against me, um... You know, cause they, cause I, was, I did so well in my job that they didn't want me to leave. I hate those people. You, you say I do a good job, but then you won't promote me. Are you serious? Cause I did my job so well. What kind of backwards analogy is that? So yeah, people called in for a reference to ask how my job performance was, and they were tanking me. Cause I'm like, what is going on? I'm going to the interview. I'm rocking the interview. They giving me hope that I'm gonna get the job, but then. Nothing. 
Yeah, I found out somebody sabotaged me because I did so well in my job, they wanted to keep me there. However, then along came somebody that saw the potential in me that said, I want you to work for me. Rest was history. Got upgraded. I worked my way up. Nobody can take that from me. Even though they tried to say she hired me illegally, you can't do nothing illegally as far as hiring in the government. Are you kidding? They got rules for everything. And even if you did, if they did find out, once it got the HR, oh, that's a wrap. Lie on your resume if you want to. No matter when they, they catch you, wrap. Trust me. People, I had one lady say, well, I don't understand how she got that job. And blah, 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 blah. But I'm the hardest worker in there. What you mean you don't understand how I got that job? And I got a degree? Whatever. <laughs> Whatever. Okay. But, yeah. But like I said, I just, my mama told me, because I was talking to her one day, because I was so upset when I found out that somebody was sabotaging me. It was my supervisor. The one that was giving me all the bonuses. My mom told me, baby, sometimes it's just not your time. You just got to wait. And when the right time come along, you going to know it. And she was right because, you know, she also told me that some people that claim they gonna do good for you they don't mean you no good and she was talking about my supervisor and she was right because that's who was trying to sabotage me oh i wanted to get out from under that lady and her boss so bad i took a term job and if you're in the government that means you only gonna be in the job for so many months years term job was two years because for some reason they turned it two years but whatever I took it because my mama told me and this was the month before she died she told me sometimes baby it's just not your time if it's meant for you it's meant for you nobody can take it from you and that lady came along she saw the potential in me I mean, because even the other chiefs were wondering how I've been in that same position so long. Why haven't they upgraded me? You got me up before the commander giving a presentation. You got me upstairs representing my department, training 20 clerks every month, but I'm not worthy of promotion? Really? Wow. So, yeah, when she came along, took me under her wing, I worked my way up, and I got promoted. So just remember, you might get frustrated. You just might get frustrated. Take a moment to yourself. Close your eyes. Take a deep breath. In and out. In and out. Meditate a little bit. Even if you got to hum, if you got to sing, you got to tap. Whatever it is you got to do to make yourself calm down. And just know that your time is coming. You are destined for greatness. You might not think so. But you are. That's why when anybody that I supervise talk about they're trying to do something good or they're trying to upgrade, they're going to school, they're trying to get in such and such program, if you come to work every day like you're supposed to, you do what you're supposed to, don't give me no problems. If a, if a, a, a program comes along on my desk, I'm signing off on it. I'm even showing people. You could go over here, you know, they'll pay for you to go to school, you know, you could use this in your job, you know, and they have internships. Did you know that? And da, 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 da. I'm so serious because I like to see people win. Who wants to be the only winner? You know, I'm just saying. I like to see people win. So just know if it's not going the way you want it to go, it might not be your time, but your time is coming. Just like retirement. <laughs> Y'all don't know I'm ready to retire. <laughs> I 
I want to retire and be with Mr. Q and make videos. And that's all I want to do. I don't want to do nothing else. But my time is coming. It ain't my time yet. But it's coming. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> and always, always, always treat people with dignity and respect. Like the way you would want them to treat your parents. That's why a lot of people used to love me and my old dog because I used to encounter, interact like face to face with customers all the time, all day, every day. That's why a lot of times they didn't want nobody else help them. They asked for me. <laughs> because this is the thing. You never know who that person knows. Word of mouth is so powerful. It is so powerful. And if you treat everybody with dignity and respect, regardless of who they are, military rise, what their rank is, who they know, trust me, it's going to come back to you. It, it, it Trust me, it's going to come back to you. Because a lot of people were so shocked to know that I knew the executive officer of the military hospital that I worked at. I am processed them. And every time after that, any time a big wig came in, guess who they requested the end processing? And when I was having problems, I ain't got to take this. You need me, I'll be upstairs. Ooh, they be shaking in their boots. <laughs> I'm just saying. <laughs> so, yeah, like I said, it just might not be your time. So if you don't get to go to the sale this time, it just might not be your time. Just like I couldn't go to Chicago. Trust me, I wanted to go. It wasn't my time. I've never been to Chicago either. Ooh, one of the first things I know I would have been doing was looking for Garrett's. I love me some Garrett's popcorn. Have I ever talked about it on my channel? I love Garrett's. Especially the Chicago mix. I'm a foodie if y'all didn't know. <laughs> For real, for real. I'm just saying. It just wasn't my time to go. It ain't my time to go yet. But trust me, I ain't going down for the count without swinging because there's some other stuff I want to do, some places I want to go, especially to eat. <laughs> and if I say anything before I leave here, I'm going back to Italy. I loved Italy. So just remember, it might not be your time this time, but your time will come. And like I always say, if you got your mindset on doing something, start saving. You never know when that extra money going to come in handy. I save a set amount out of my check every other week. Yes, I get paid every other week. Mm -hmm. For real, for real. I save 10% of my check every other week. Yep, I sure do. Because when it was time to buy my plane ticket, yeah, I'm going to try to get the, deep, the cheapest price because I want to have my money shop with it. But if I can't get it at the price that I wanted, no sweat. I have already budgeted for it. Just like I used to drink Starbucks every day. I don't drink it as much. Well, I don't drink coffee as much as I used to. Tea is cheaper than coffee, and it helps with your vocal cords. I'm just saying, it helps with your vocal cords. Mm-hmm. So, I drink tea. It's only $2 and something cent for a venti. And you can get a refill, I'm just saying. For real, for real. So, yeah. I budget for Starbucks. People wonder, like, how you go to Starbucks every day? Because I budget for Starbucks. I, budget. I have a budget. I have a lunch budget. Even though I mainly bring my lunch now because I'm trying to watch what I eat. And ladies and gentlemen, watching what you eat, you will feel so much better. If all you eat is junk, you're going to feel like junk. For real, for real. Get you some green, leafy stuff. Now, I don't know about that kale thing, though. I ain't feeling kale. But I would, I would eat some spinach, <laughs> some broccoli. I'm just saying. For real, for real. Find what you like. You know what I'm saying? Somebody Sandy Chris says she likes she drinks only iced Americanos and put my own coffee cream. Hey, ain't nothing wrong with that. Using your own coffee cream. Y'all let me 
me get off this phone and see what CJ uh, barking at. All right, y'all. Thank y'all for joining me for For Real Friday. And um, don't forget, Pauline, are you on tomorrow? We've missed you two Saturdays in a row. <laughs> Also, don't forget, Do That 615 is on Sunday night. Well, Sunday evening, 6 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And if Pauline Newman, yay, Pauline Newman's going to be on tomorrow at 11 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. All right, I will see y'all next week. Until next time, love y'all. Have a good night. Be blessed.